I'm not, I can only speak for myself. These are my experiences, guys. Like, it's. Monday it is 4 12 p.m. I actually just got in for work I just put on my little house dress and I ran downstairs and picked up my Amazon package because I told you guys to contact paper for my tabletop and the um, shelves the black beans for the shelves made it today so I'm gonna open this up and also today is my fasting day I fast every single Monday you know when I'm not on vacation or off track or anything like that if I'm on track I'm fasting on Monday I started my fast last night at 8 15 p.m and i'll end it tomorrow at 11 15 p.m which ends up being a 39 hour fast but yeah your girl is fasting but i am going to have my tea today and the tea that i'm going to do for today is going to be one of the sorry about the lighting it's going to be one of the cbd raspberry lemonade teas and then one regular tea i really like mixing those together because the raspberry tea is flavored and then the original tea is um a, like an unsweet tea flavor so you don't have to like worry about putting sweetener or anything in it like the actual cbd tea actually flavors it so it's really really good and i do use two tea packets and one 16.9 ounce bottles of water so yeah that's what's gonna happen but first let's go ahead and open up this package because i am dying to see what's inside so i'm gonna put you guys down here on my desk and then we're gonna get to opening this package and with my laptop i only have one more cup of water to do once i finish this and then i'll be finished with my gallon for today it was a monday at work y'all it was a monday i'm trying to sit y'all down it was a monday child like Ain't nobody got time. This is a bad angle, but this is what we gotta do. I got my handy dandy razor. I bought this from Dollar Tree and it came with refills as well. But let's go ahead and get this package opened so I can see what I'm working with. But normally, y'all, when I come home from work, first of all, if y'all hear anything, I have a neighbor upstairs that has children and they run all day, y'all. Like, Legit, I don't know if he be skateboarding or what he be doing, but I mean, he can get a little rowdy, but you know, you know how that goes. <laughs> Look, I, my mama said if you don't have anything nice to say. Okay, let's get up. All right, so, yeah. Oh, these are these blue or no? They're black. Okay. Uh oh, Kristen, I'm over here turning stuff up. It's okay. It's okay. Alrighty, so here they are. It's just a six pack of the black beans, and it is the. I want to say the eleven. Do I say it on here? It's yes. It's an eleven by ten point seventy five by ten point seventy five. So it fits in the nine cube organizers very well. I bought these from um these nine cube organizers right here. I'm pointing to this one, but I bought these from Big Lots and they were thirty nine ninety nine. But you can get them from Target. You can get them from Walmart. You can pretty much get them from wherever they sell like furniture storage or whatever. So yeah, I got these and I only did six because I'm thinking about putting them just down the middle. But we'll go over that and then i'm excited about this but what i'm really excited about is my contact paper so looking at it it's not as black as i thought it was gonna be like i thought the gray part was gonna be it's not focused so yeah i thought the gray part was gonna be more black but i'm okay with that because at least that'll bring out like the silver aspects of it and like it still goes with everything i just thought it was gonna be like a darker black but i'm not sad about it so this is a 15.7 by 78.7 and i got it this big because the desk is really long it's not like wide but it's long or whatever so i got two rows um so hopefully this is enough to actually fill it and then the only other thing in here is my other pack of the storage bins so everything came in so far what i ordered i ordered the bins contact paper to do my desk ordered the rug that made it 
I need to keep this box because your girlfriend, uh, now that I got this all set up, I need to go ahead and start listing everything for Poshmark. I know a couple y'all reached out and was like, sis, we waiting on the sale. It's coming. And I thank you guys for being patient with me. Y'all know I'm a one woman show. So I like have to work all day. Then I have to record it, edit, upload, and do all this stuff. Sometimes I get really, really busy. So I appreciate the support even when I'm not active. But y'all know I always try to come back with the quickness. So I am going to do this. This is my first time ever doing contact paper myself so i'm gonna see how i can record it if i can record it hopefully this is enough i mean like this better be enough if not i'm have to order some more but anyway um it's 4 18 now and i like to have my tea as soon as i walk in the house so on mondays i do take the tea when i get home from work um because i'm already like at work all day fasting and stuff like that but every other day of the week, I do take my tea at work before lunch. And you guys will see that throughout this week. Because um, I'm actually going to vlog every day and give y'all like a real, real, you know what I'm saying, uh, vlog this week. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and make my tea. Like I said, I do use two packets in one bottle. If this is your first time doing ISO tea, I would say just use one packet the first couple days just to get it in your body. Get your body used to the product and then go up to two if this is your first time i would not recommend just jumping out the gate doing two um especially if you've never done detox tea or a detox before this stuff is legit and it works now there is little to no cramping i did not experience any cramping or i do not experience any cramping because my body is used to detox stuff i still well i was taking teeny now i still do my teamy greens as you guys will see tomorrow in my smoothie i do teamy greens but um i ran out of the colon tea and i never restocked so that's the reason why i like got this tea and stuff so i don't i will do a comparison video for you guys comparing teamy to iso because i got that question so i'll get that done for you guys but for right now i'm just focusing on the iso team but yeah if it's your first time i'll say just do one you can do a regular or you can do the cbd with the cbd tea it does come in raspberry and lemon so you can get either one now this is raspberry lemonade and then they have a lemon one and then this is unsweetened so this is pretty much just like if you go to a restaurant and you ask for unsweet tea that's what it tastes like just unsweet tea but i'll show you guys later in the week how i drink this because i know too i got some questions on like this because i don't mind the unsweet tea flavor but not everybody likes it so i'll give you a quick little recipe to try this out but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and do two because again for one my body is acclimated to the product and i'm used to taking detox tea um and then for two because i'm on week three so i'm gonna take two um so yeah only thing that you do is i do take my water and drink a little out of it just so i can shake it because the one thing that I have noticed um, with this too is by it being um, just like an instant powder. It's not like powder. It's more grainy than it is powder. Um, so yeah, you have to shake it a little bit because once it hits the water, it clumps up. So all you have to do is just shake it. Just put a little elbow grease in it. That's all you have to do. Get a little elbow grease in it. <laughs> so that's the regular tea. And then I go ahead and open the cbd tea and the cbd tea is like for um you know just help like you know how cbd became the rave and everybody takes it for like focusing and um pain and you know just helping with everything that's what it is there's no thc in here so if you drink this tea you won't be high you ain't gotta worry about being high <laughs> so that's cool and it even tells you on there 0, 0.0 percent thc so you shouldn't be feeling no drug test drinking this CBD tea. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so I just put both of my tea packets in. And as you can see, it kind of like clumps up. And all you do is shake, 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 shake it up. And you just shake it. Now, the one thing that I honestly can say already that I like is the convenience of this tea. Because with the teamy tea, you know, you have to brew it. And then for me, since I took teamy for so long, I used to have to brew mine a little longer. So I will brew mine in the morning and then let it steep all day. Um, 
And so, yeah, that can just be a pain because if you forget to brew it in the morning or if you don't have time to brew it or if you're not, you know, on the go or something, you don't have time, then you'll miss your tea. But I love, love, love that this is instant. So you just add it to water. And I do also like that it's cold. You add it to cold water. But you can also add it to room temperature water. You can add it to hot water if you want. But see, she want to drink it. So you don't want to add it to too much hot water. <laughs> but, yeah, you just, what I do is I shake mine up really, really good. And I'm going to try to show y'all you can kind of see in there that it's still a little grainy and little stuff floating so just shake it up just shake 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 it up i let it sit and let the fizz go down and then i shake it up till i don't see that and then i literally drink it super fast because with the cbd tea in the res i mean the regular tea mix it has like a really sweet flavor and it tastes like a flavored tea so yeah i go ahead and get that in or whatever so i drink this um on my fasting day now um the tea does have 10 calories in it but you can have up to 50 calories before you actually break your fast on most things on detox tea i feel comfortable with anything else i don't really feel comfortable with like y'all won't see me eating you know a couple grapes because it's under 50 calories because that's food and the whole point of fasting is so that your system kind of like shuts down like the digestive kind of shuts down so it can get rid of what's already in there so yeah i don't want to like you know mess that up but i don't mind taking a detox tea even when i did a water fast for three days i took the tea every single day and i took my nrg every single day and nothing happened so, like, I still lost weight. Y'all saw I lost 16 pounds. Well, almost 17 pounds. So, yep, it looks really good right now. I don't really see too many more clumps in it. I'm going to give it one more good shake. And that's why I say you want to drink a little out of it because you actually want it to have room to shake up. And especially since I put two in mine. You know what? If you put one in there, you probably won't have to drink none out of it, but... Yeah, so I'll let that sit for a few minutes or whatever. But yes, I just wanted to come and update you guys, let y'all know that I did receive the package and stuff, um, and that I will be doing this. Now, I'll probably just go ahead and wait till this weekend to get this done so I can actually take my time. I don't want to rush and like mess it up and then i saw like i've watched videos on top of videos on top of videos and people said that like bubbles can get in it like if you rush or if you pull to some so i want to take my time and do that but i am probably gonna play with the bins and uh see if i want to like in a row or how i'm going to do that um and then i'm going to drink my tea and then the way i'm going to end the night is just mercy on amazon prime is with michael b jordan and jamie fox it has, you know, a lot to, to do with um, just pretty much kind of what's going on today in the world or whatever. Um, so, yeah, me and baby been want to watch it. And Amazon Prime is giving it away free for people to watch just to kind of educate yourself, know what's going on and stuff like that. So, we're going to have like a little movie night, you know, watch that movie. Baby baked her some chicken. And these were some big ass chickens. Now, I got to take y'all in the kitchen show y'all these chickens. Baby, you up? Uh, she up. I'm gonna take y'all in the kitchen and show y'all these chickens that this girl done cooked. They look like turkey legs. They so big. Look, okay, I'm gonna show y'all real fast. She said, "My get out my chicken." Sorry, the camera look like this. I'm going from natural light to yellow light, and then on top of that, I do have the cam the camera angled at like a bad angle. Man, all these chickens smell good though. They look so good. Hold on, y'all. Man, look at these chickens. These chickens are huge, though, y'all. Like, one chicken probably will be my serving size. But I'm not eating this. This is baby's dinner or whatever. I am fasting, so I don't eat anything today. I'm only going to drink my tea. And then, um... Tomorrow when I break my fast, I have my smoothies, but don't worry because this vlog right here I'm just gonna kind of take you guys with me all week long show you how I do stuff Oh, oh, you want to cover your chicken say hey to the people don't even know they think we ain't even married no more They ain't seen you no more Don't you put your dimple there <laughs> Yes, yeah. I know we married but they ain't even seen you your name on the channel. Do I need to take your name off the channel ma'am? I don't need to take your name off Okay, I ain't gonna take a nigga mom. Yeah. What's up, y'all? She just woke up too. I came in and had some more cups. So. Miss me. I know. Well, you wanna put this water up? Oh, I'm gonna move them other bottles in there. We just put it in the refrigerator. Yeah, I'm gonna put it in, baby. But yeah, so I'm gonna get ready and enjoy my tea. Like I said, baby got her chicken going on. Then we're gonna watch it just mercy. So I'll let you guys know how it is. And other than that, nothing much else is going on today. Like, for one, normally on fasting days, sis come home and sis be tired. Sis, sis lay down. Be, sis be in the bed. Sis be in the bed. But what sis be doing now, baby? Tell them. 
Sis ain't been in bed last three Mondays. And why? Because I've been doing energy. Like, no lie, y'all. That stuff is legit. Like, it yeah. takes your appetite. You know when MC Hammer make that song? Um, what's that song? Dang, what's that song? I was just talking about it. Wait, can't touch this. And you be doing, oh, oh, oh. That's how every day she goes, oh, oh, oh. And it's because, and look, I didn't even take my Nutri Burst today because on my full fasting days, I don't take the Nutri Burst because it's a multivitamin and I like to take vitamins with food. So I don't take my Nutri Burst on my Mondays because I fast, but I do take my ISOT. But yeah, this is literally you just know, NRG. I know. I just, y'all, it be just too lit. It, I be just too lit, like all the time. So again, um, bye for today. Bye for today. Yes. Bye tomorrow. Uh, look at you. Is you gonna be in here tomorrow in the vlog? Yep. We'll see y'all. Hold her to it. Turn, turn her butt up in them comments. But anyway, y'all, that's all I got for today. Like I said, don't worry. I'll show you guys um, everything that I do for the whole week. I'll show you guys all the food and stuff put together. Y'all see them boxes right there? I need to sit those out. My um, valet trash said they do take boxes as long as you break them down. So I did break them down. I just need to put them out. Every time I put the trash out, I forget about the boxes. And then the next day, I'll be like, don't forget the boxes. And then I forget the boxes. <laughs> um, but yeah. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along with me so that way you'll see all the food put together of what I cooked. And then I thought about too, I did not show you guys how to cook spaghetti squash, remember? And I'm having spaghetti squash, so don't worry. I'll show you guys how I cook it because I cook mine in the microwave. You can cook it in the oven and all sorts of ways, but y'all know Crystal, lazy dieter. <laughs> I like to cook mine in the microwave and it tastes just the same. Like I've had it in the oven and in the microwave and you really can't tell the difference. So I'll show you guys that and everything like that. So just stay tuned to see what this week will bring us. I got both of my smoothies packed up. I also got my Nutriburst because I do take that when I um, break my fast. And then, um, oh, that's all I brought. Oh, and a bottle of water because I'm going to take my tea um, at work today too. So before I leave the house every day, I do take my NRG. This is what baby was telling y'all about. Y'all, it give me crunk. Like on my fasting days, I'm up, I'm moving around. I don't have an appetite. Like I have energy like crazy. Um, so yeah, these are the NRG pills. You just take one. I do take mine before I leave the house. Um, and then I just leave them here. Um, and then yeah, I like it immediately start working. Like it curves your appetite like none other. So I'm gonna get ready and take my NRG and then I'm gonna grab my lunch bag and head out. And, and the next time y'all see me, I will be getting ready to break my fat. Alrighty y'all, I had to put y'all on my phone real fast cause I'm busy today. It is 12.53 and I'm just now breaking my fat. So I have officially fasted for over 40 hours. And when I break my fast, I do go ahead and take my Nutri Burst. And with this, it's a vitamin, um, multivitamin. So you gotta make sure you shake it up. And once you open it, you do need to refrigerate it. Um, but yeah, I just go ahead and get this shook up really good. And it's just so you don't take the vitamin taste. And it has kind of like a citrusy flavor to it. So it's not nasty at all. You do taste vitamin like after, but it's, it's not too much to handle. But yeah, you just take the top off. And now with the new packaging, they have white tops. But yeah, you just take the top off and I just pour it. Oh, look. I should have, I wish I had my camera, but anyway. I just pour it in here. Oh, y'all can see it. And then I just go ahead. So it is 12.54. I fasted for 40 hours and like 30 something minutes. So cheers. And that's it. That's my multivitamin. It's done. Um, This does have 15 calories. 
you can technically take it while you're fasting and it won't break your fast, but it is vitamin. So I don't like to take that if I'm not going to eat anything. But I'm also breaking my fast with my green smoothie. Y'all saw me make this this morning. And this one has the teamy green in it. Just one tablespoon of it. Um, or one of the spoons that come in the container. And then I do have another one. Oh, it's right here. My actual other one. I need to go back and put it in the refrigerator. But I have this one. And this is the same smoothie. It just does not have the scoop of the teamy greens in it. Because you only need one scoop a day. So I only put it in the first shake. Since I'm breaking my fast. So I can get those nutrients. And then I go ahead. This is just my regular one that I told you guys about. With the PB2 and stuff like that. So that's the only thing I'm having so far. Uh oh. That's the only thing I'll be having today. Like I said, it's late. It's already about to be one. And normally I'll be on my second smoothie by one. So, um. I don't, I'm going to try my best to uh, get everything down or I might end up having to do one with dinner. I don't know how I'm going to do that. But, of course, I'm vlogging, so I'll come back and update you guys. But as of right now, Nutribush is in. And the whole crazy part about it is I didn't even realize it. I had a meeting with my bosses today, and it was over an hour long. And I remember saying to myself in the meeting, like, take your smoothie with you so you can break your fast but i was like no i ain't gonna take it in there and we had a whole meeting until 12 and then i came back and got caught up with emails and didn't even realize what time it was like that energy works like no appetite i'm literally about to just make sure that i eat this or drink this smoothie because i need the nutrients or whatever and I did refill my water cup. This is cup number three, which makes this 72 ounces. I have five of these a day. So I'll be having this cup number three. Pretty much y'all saw the video that I did with how to drink a gallon of water in a day. But what I've been doing is I drink two of these while I'm fasting in the morning, like one at home, one when I get here. And then I take my third cup, which is this cup. Um, and I drink that with my breakfast, which, you know, tomorrow I'll have the turkey bacon and stuff. And then for, I have another cup for lunch and another cup for dinner. So that's how I'm able to get my five cups in. And then bonus, I always do get an extra 16 ounces because I have my water to do my tea. So I always do over a gallon of water. I think I made like 138 ounces every day. And it just works out that way. And I'm able to, you know, it's not too much, me doing too much. But anyway, I just wanted to come and update you guys. It finally simmered down. So I'm going to sit up here, check some emails because uh, y'all are purchasing the tea. Thank you so much link in the description box below if you want some um so yeah i need to check my emails and do what i need to do with that sip on my smoothie and i will pick you guys up a little later to update you. all righty guys so i'm home i put my turkey bacon on the pizza tray don't judge me i just did not want to find the uh cookie sheet to put it on and i only need some for wednesday thursday friday so i'm just gonna throw this in the oven and then i have my eggs over here boiling i'm gonna have one egg for breakfast every day but i have two extra ones because i decided i'm gonna do tuna egg cups for dinner tonight because it's something light and i really don't have an appetite yeah. I had to switch y'all around. And I don't have an appetite. I told y'all earlier that NRG is the truth. And guess what? I still got a whole smoothie in here that I made that I'm not going to drink today. But I can drink it in the morning. It does refrigerate well. So um, tomorrow, instead of having strawberries with my meal, I'll go ahead and have my smoothie with it just so I won't waste it or whatever. So that's what I'll have. Um, but yeah, I'm doing my turkey bacon. I'm about to put it in the oven as soon as it's finished preheating. My eggs are boiling. But I will come back and show you guys my tuna egg cups um, once they're done. Because I know I got a couple questions about it. But pretty much, I just make the tuna the way I like it. So you make your tuna the way that you like your tuna made. And then put it inside the egg whites. Like once you split it in half, that's all you have to do. And I do use two eggs. I thought I would need three. But um, I do only use two eggs. Because I get full fast. And then this is the tuna that I use. It is the chunk like tuna in water in the pouch. And I like this tuna the best because, oh, excuse me, it does not have a metallic taste. You know, sometimes if you get that tuna at the can, it can taste like metallic -y. So, yeah. Um, I like that one and it's easier, it's more convenient and I do use Miracle Whip in my tuna. I was using mayo, but on Weight Watchers, mayo is four points and Miracle Whip is one point. So which one y'all think I choose? <laughs> I choose the Miracle Whip. So yes, I'm home. I got a little bit more water to finish with this and then I'll be on my last cup, which will be my gallon. And I still need to do my tea. I didn't get to do my tea at work today because I had that really long meeting. Um, so I wasn't able to like do my tea. And then like I told y'all, I did have an appetite. I only had a smoothie so far today. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and do my tea right now so I can get it in. Cause you do do this tea every day. It is gentle enough to do daily. That is another difference between the teamy and the ISO is with the teamy. You have to do it every other day. 
um because i try to do it every day you don't want to do that to me every day <laughs> but with the iso tea it is gentle enough to do daily or whatever so yeah i'm home i'm about to chop it up with baby let my food get done or whatever um and then take my tea so i'll pick you guys up a little later and here's my dinner, my tuna egg cups. I did have some leftover tuna, so I'll just eat that on the side. And I'm gonna have it with some nut thins. These are 90 calorie individual pack. And then I decided to bust over my strawberry water to go ahead and finish out my water intake for today. So I want something sweet with dinner. And then I'm gonna have a no sugar added pineapple cup with this. So this ends up being six points. Three points for the tuna because of the miracle whip, but the tuna is zero and the egg is zero. And then three points for the nut thins and then zero points for the water so this is what i'm gonna have for dinner and after this i'm just gonna chill out so i will pick you guys up on tomorrow so what's up guys and happy wednesday i am at work i've been at work all morning i've already had two of my 24 ounce cups of water and your girl is about to get ready and break up fast so just stay tuned to see what i'm about to eat today Alrighty guys, so here is my breakfast. As y'all can see, it is 11-11, so I'm about to get ready and break my fast. I already did take my shot of Nutriburst because I do it as soon as I break my fast so I can get my multivitamin in, and then I go ahead and eat breakfast. And like I told you guys yesterday, I drink five of these 24-ounce cups a day. So this is cup number three with me. I always do three with breakfast. I do four with lunch and five with dinner, and that's how I'm able to get my whole gallon in. Um, so my turkey bacon, I have four pieces of low sodium um turkey bacon from butterball and it is three points and the egg is zero points the water is zero points and then my smoothie this is the one from yesterday it looks a bit like liquidy um because i made it yesterday and it's been in the refrigerator it held up well so i'm gonna go ahead and um drink this and believe it or not i actually do like mine like this it just drinks better to me i don't really care for it to be thicker so this works for me but my whole smoothie is four points so four points three points zero zero my total break breakfast is seven points all right guys so it is that time to take my tea it is 12 37 and i'm going to be eating lunch probably about 1 1 15 and you want to take your tea 30 minutes before you eat or that's what i do i take it 30 minutes before i eat lunch just so it can get in my system and everything so yeah your girl's about to do it i got another regular tea and another of the raspberry lemonade cbd tea and like i told you sometimes i do um just do two regulars i've never did two raspberries Ooh, i should try that see how that is but anyway i have um i normally either do two of these or i do this whatever but yeah i'm about to get ready to make my tea so i can drink it and then i'll come back and show you guys lunch Alrighty, guys so here is lunch i only decided to do two of those muffin cups because your girl will be getting full and i know i could wouldn't be able to eat three so i do have two servings of those i have a half a cup of the mashed cauliflower which sour cream and chives and then i have my beloved pineapple fruit cup it's the no sugar added and it's zero points so the mini meatloaf muffins are um one point a piece so it's two points for that four points for the half of the cup of the mashed cauliflower zero points and then this is my fourth cup of water which is 96 ounces and that is zero points so my total lunch is only six points Alrighty, guys so i'm home and it is dinner time and i'm gonna go ahead and start off by cooking my spaghetti squash i do cook mine in the microwave and this one is fairly small the bigger ones that i get i normally cook for 15 minutes so what i do is i go ahead and stab it you know just to get um some holes in it so it can vent in the microwave and then i put it in the microwave just like this hole um you can put leave put it in the microwave just like this on the microwave plate nothing that has never happened or you can put it on the microwave safe plate whichever you decide but yeah you just poke holes in it put it in and i used to put it on nine minutes first and then you want to take it out and roll it over and then put it on the rest of the minutes that you have um but since this one is fairly small it may only take 10 minutes so i'm gonna put it in on five and then roll it over and just see how it goes but worst case scenario you just want it to get be soft enough to cut because like right now it's hard you know so you just want it to be soft enough to cut um so whenever you can be able to push in then you'll be able to um get ready and cut it but don't worry because i'm going to show you guys the whole process so stay tuned to see how to make spaghetti squash in the microwave Right, guys so as you can see it is mushy and ready to be cut so the only thing that you have to do is just go ahead and cut it in half 
and then you're gonna see some seeds in it. You take the seeds out and then you use a fork and scrape out the spaghetti noodles. So just stay tuned and see what they look like. And so that is your spaghetti squash. This, I can honestly say, is the most sp spaghetti looking noodles that I didn't have. Like, I, they normally look like this, but I just don't know. These look almost perfect, like a real pasta. So I'm about to get ready and chop up my chicken fajita. So I'm gonna do four ounces of this chicken fajita, and then I'm going to do my homemade Alfredo sauce that I made in the last vlog. And I'll come back and show you guys the final results of what it's gonna look like. finished product this is the homemade skinny alfredo sauce that i made in last vlog this is four smart points for one fourth of a cup if you do want your sauce you you can add more but i made my sauce thicker so i just like it to coat it it doesn't have to be like really really saucy just as long as i can taste it and then i have four ounces of that chicken fajita chicken um by john souls and that is two points and then i'm going to have a, another pineapple tidbit cup that's zero points and then the cooked spaghetti squash just a half a cup of that for zero points so my whole dinner is six smart points alrighty guys it's project time I went ahead and laid the paper out just so I can see what I'm working with and I actually do see that it is like more black you know in here than I thought it was so I am totally in love and I'm definitely gonna need two rows because it's not as wide but it is long enough so that's a good thing so I'll just overlap them and I watched the video on how to make sure to overlap and stuff like that so I cannot record this because I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> so I'm gonna take my time and actually do it instead of like trying to set the camera up and stuff um so I am gonna go ahead and do it and I'll come back and show you guys the finished product the thing that the video said is just make sure you use Windex to wipe the table down first and make sure that it's dry so that the adhesive can actually stick and then they say use a credit card to smooth it out but I was at Dollar Tree and I found this chopper slash scraper that is like really thin and it has like a really good grip on it so I said I can use this to kind of scrape out the air bubbles or whatever and if I get to a point where I feel like I can record I will but if not y'all don't be mad at me <laughs> I just want to uh you know, see if I can get this project done. This is my first time doing it. So stay tuned to see what it's gonna look like. This is definitely not perfect. As you can see, I do have like some um, lines in the paper from where it was rolled up, but I'm going to have stuff on the desk too to actually decorate it so it doesn't disappoint me too much. But I was able to do the edges and stuff and it looks really good. So looking from the door, that is what we're looking like. And I did order some more bins. They're just on... Um, not back order they're not in stock yet so amazon said they will ship as soon as they're in stock because this is the design that i came up with well actually me and courtney d d agreed on it um so yeah i'm just gonna put four more right here and then the open shelves that you see i'm gonna decorate that with just something girly i'm thinking about doing some diy books i'm gonna put like some cute little trinkets candles rings watches just you know something that is cute and girly, but still counts as like storage. Cause again, I want this to be functional and cute. So this is what it looks like though with all of the beans. And I do see that the letters and stuff are on there. I'm gonna peel those off. 
I still haven't decided, am I going to do anything to the white ones? Like, am I going to, you know, put rhinestones on it or am I going to outline them with black? Or I haven't decided yet, but right now this is how they look. But yes, I love it. It looks really good. Like I said, when you're coming in from the door, like, boom, that's what I wanted. Like, I wanted the tabletop to be its own design and everything else to just be basic so yes and i am loving this rug y'all i love it i love it i love it. it is soft it's cushy it does fluff out it gives me that velvet feel i love it so much but anyway i wasn't even supposed to be vlogging today today is thursday um and i was gonna like take the day off so that way i can just finish out this vlog for y'all and edit but i was like let me go ahead and get this table done so i was able to um do this for you guys and also i did have some more left over so it's not like a whole whole lot left but it's enough to do another project that's why i said i might do a diy project and like make something else in her marble i did see a girl that did a diy project and she made her mirror marble like the outside of it but i really like the black mirror so let me take that back <laughs> i'm not doing it let's let's be honest this is all you're gonna get but yes it turned out so beautiful and oh my god i got a surprise for the curtains all i'm gonna say is one of my lovely subscribers reached out to me and she is buying curtains as a housewarming gift and i appreciate her so i'll just save that at first i was gonna like show y'all the picture and stuff but i'll just save it for when they come or whatever i'm so so excited it was so sweet of her she just found the perfect ones to just accent the room and you know we agreed on them and she is so sweet she bought them and she is sending them so as soon as they come in and i get them up you guys will see that but yeah now it's time since I have my desk ready for me to decorate it. So, like I said, it's not perfect. You do see a couple bubbles and stuff, but I ain't even tripping about that. I do, though, want to, like, make it cute, but not too cluttered, especially since the desk is a pattern itself. So, yeah, I'm going to be looking for different things to put on my desk. And also, I, I need a printer. <laughs> but, yeah, um, I don't want to keep rambling. I just want to come and show you guys that your girl was productive and got the desk done. So, what's up, guys? And happy Friday. Today is July 3rd. I know you thinking like, sis, didn't the vlog say that it was June the 14th? Yes, sis, that was two weeks ago. It has been a crazy two weeks, but I still wanted to show you that footage because it was very relevant. It showed you guys what I do when I go from fasting on Monday to breaking my fast on Tuesday by having those two smoothies. And then I always have a dinner on Tuesday, which I decided to do tuna cups. And then Wednesday starts my full day of eating. But I wanted to come at the end of this vlog and one, update you guys on TLC, give you a little quick weight loss update on what's going on with that. And then I asked you guys questions, um, or I asked you guys to ask me questions two weeks ago. Um, so I want to answer those questions in here. And then I want to give you an update on my glam office and a couple things that I am working on around the apartment. And then that'll wrap up this vlog. And then I should be back on track. So I'm just going to kind of update you guys. So first things first, as you can see, your girl did get her nails done. This this is a very, very loud hot pink s, &S pow powder and it is glow in the dark and Demisha, like she got your girl all the way together. So I just feel so much better. The next project on myself is to get these brows threaded and to get this hair done. So that is coming within the next couple of weeks. So stay tuned because I'll bring you guys along on that process. Thank you guys for all the comments on like my natural hair and my curls and stuff. I love it sis and I can even see that my hair has grown. Um, if you can remember a couple of vlogs back, I was telling you guys like I was experiencing like thinning hair and stuff from weight loss, but I can actually see that like it is getting full again. Me and baby be talking about my puff. This last week I even wore like different hairstyles and stuff. Like I was trying to do something different with my natural hair and I love it. Um, but I just, I miss my bundles. I'm sorry. I just miss my bundles. So I am definitely going back to sew-ins. So yeah, I'll be getting my hair sewn in. Um, I do have another nail appointment prayers if don't nothing close down because of everything that's going on with the pandemic but my next nail appointment will be july 16th um so i just hope everything goes good to where you know we don't have to like go back to shelter in place and you know close everything down um but yeah these last two weeks have been crazy y'all like work has been 
so so crazy i have been going through so much at work and i do want to talk to you guys about it um because you know i share my life with y'all um but i honestly needed to get out of the situation that i was going through because i was very upset i am still very upset um and it's, it's just a lot so dealing with work has been a lot um but as far as the apartment like everything has been going good my office is almost together i did get to show you guys some of this footage with this contact paper i still do see a couple bubbles but again i really don't care about it because i still am gonna like decorate it and i sit here and work anyway so i'm okay with that um it's like what pretty much what i'm saying is it's not a perfect job and i'm okay with that but it does look really good i've got some stuff for the patio and then we got a new vacuum cleaner that i'm so excited about like that's how you know that you don't made it to your mid-30s when you're excited about vacuum cleaners and stuff like that <laughs> so yes i'll show you guys that but anyway to update you on my weight loss and everything that's going on with that so i am still loving all of my iso products i still do the iso t the nrg and the nutriverse and hopefully you guys understood what i was uh, doing in the beginning clips but if not i'll go ahead and clarify now so pretty much what happens is sunday night i start my fast and um, I know a lot of people say, oh, well, I thought you just do a full day fast. How does it end up being 39 or 40 hours? And it's because I start Sunday night and I don't break it until Tuesday at my eating window. Some people who do 24 hour fast, they may start Sunday night at 830 and then they'll break their fast Monday night at 830, which is a full 24 hours. But instead of me breaking my fast on Monday nights, I go ahead and continue fasting until Tuesday when it's time for me to actually jump into my intermediate fasting window so that's how i'm able to like go from a full day fast straight into my fasting window so i start sunday nights and like i said it just depends i really don't stress myself on when i start so when i start at seven or eight or nine ten whatever time i start i go ahead and use the life app and i just hit start fast and then it counts up until i break my fast on tuesdays so um yeah so monday the only thing that i do is do tea i don't even do my neutral base because it's a multivitamin and i don't want to take that um on an empty stomach since i'm fasting but i do take my nrg now on the nrg packaging it does say take with food but literally the whole what month now month and a week or so well, a month and almost a week that I've been taking it, I don't take mine with food and I don't experience anything crazy. I actually take mine before I leave home because I don't take it with me. So I just pop it, drink some water, and I'm telling you, the NRG is lit, y'all. It is lit. I say it all the time. Literally, literally mean it. But yeah, so on Mondays, I take my NRG and I do drink my tea and I fast. No food, no other kind of drinks or anything that day. And then on Tuesday at 11 a.m., my, my eating window is from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. So on Tuesday at 11 a.m., I break my fast by one starting with my Nutriburst because that's my multivitamin so I go ahead and take my multivitamin because I'm about to get ready to eat breakfast and even though it's just a smoothie it's not technically eating it is still substance that's going to be in my belly and not an empty stomach so I go ahead and take my Nutriburst which is just a cap food like I showed you and then I drink my first smoothie and if everything goes as planned then I drink my tea before I have my second smoothie then I have a second smoothie and then when I come home from work I I'll have dinner it depends on what i have made sometimes i do chili sometimes i do those tuna cups or sometimes i just go straight into whatever i made for meal prep that week um but yeah the nrg really curves my appetite y'all and what i've learned from all the meal prep that i showed y'all is i can't eat that much food anymore like I used to like I've gotten to the point on my own where I don't snack you guys don't ever see me like bring up little snacks and stuff because I'm not really a snacker anymore I used to be but I really broke myself out of that well actually I'll be honest intermediate fasting broke me out of snacking um because since my eating window is only eight hours and I'm at work and I get busy and stuff it's like once I eat breakfast I get busy and when I look up it's lunchtime and then I get busy and then when I look up it's time to go home and then when I come home I'm preparing for dinner so I really broke myself out of snacking um so I don't snack but no lie taking that NRG um it really like curves my appetite to where I'm not even hungry. So when I do like force myself to eat something, I can't eat a lot. So although I did have like the turkey bacon, the egg, and then I had the um, meatloaf cups with the mashed cauliflower, and then I tried to come home and have spaghetti squash and alfredo sauce, that didn't work for you, girl. I didn't even 
finish that um dish whatsoever i could not finish it it was just it was too much <laughs> so um what i started doing is now i'll have only a smoothie for breakfast just to get some substance in my body then i'll have lunch and then i'll have dinner but even then like i have been like cutting what i'm eating like this past week right here for meal prep i had um me love muffin cups and green beans for lunch and then i had some um what did i eat for dinner oh i made broccoli cheddar soup now that is not a part of the vlog if you follow me on instagram then you saw me go over the ingredients and then i showed the finished product i just wanted to make it first because i never made a soup or anything so i wanted to make it first but definitely 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 it's a hit y'all i have got to share that with you so don't worry that definitely will be coming up because i'll be making it for meal prep again it was so good but yes your girl can not eat that much so i had to realize that i probably can't have three full meals so that's why i just went back to my smoothies for breakfast now when it comes to your smoothies you can make any kind of smoothie you want i just like my spinach and pb2 and stuff like that and especially like i told y'all my doctor is pro spinach <laughs> so she wants me to get as much spinach as my di in my diet as i can so that's the way for me to get it in with my breakfast so yeah so that's what i end up doing this week or whatever but yes that energy is lit um but going back to my routine so yeah on Tuesdays I do both smoothies and then dinner and then on Wednesday when I break my fast at 11 a.m. I go ahead and have my breakfast and then I do my lunch 30 I mean I'm sorry not my lunch my tea 30 minutes before lunch so if I know I'm gonna eat lunch around 1 15 1 30 I'll have my tea by 12 30 12 45 just to have it in again the directions say 30 minutes before you eat but realistically it still works whether you take it 30 minutes before you eat or whether you drink it while you eat like I have did both ways and it still works it's still effective and I like taking my tea at work because it like actually has time to settle when I take my tea when I get home and in the evening I find that I'm up in the middle of the night using the restroom um because that tea is a detox tea and it is meant to clean you out meaning clean your colon but it's a very gentle detox meaning you one can take it daily and two it doesn't cause like cramping or like you having to run to the restroom that's why I am able to drink my tea at work during the day at one o'clock you know in the daytime and I don't even get home to after four you don't have to worry about sitting next to a toilet or anything like that now when it's time to go you will know it'll be like your normal regular like uh oh I gotta use the restroom and it is a very good time to go to the restroom and y'all know i'm blunt so i'm telling you sis it cleans you out but it is very very good if you are experiencing cramping when you first drink the tea for one understand that it is a it's trying to like deeply clean you like cold and clean so you may have some buildup in there and it is just pretty much trying to, you know, pump everything out or whatever, but you shouldn't cramp the whole time you take it. It, like I said, if you do experience any cramping, it'll be maybe, you know, the first couple days when you take it just cause it's trying to get you cleaned out. Um, but like I said, since I've done detox teas forever, then my body is pretty used to detox and what, you know, it does with the body. So I experienced no cramping or whatever. So yes, like pretty much that is my routine. I try to stick to that every day. Like I said, some days it don't work for me. So I do end up drinking my tea at home or I do end up drinking it like later in the evening, but it really does not matter guys. It still works. It's still very effective. Effective. I still do take mine every single day and so yeah pretty much the last time I talked to you guys I was 220.3 or something if I remember I can't remember but yeah the last time I talked to you guys we just gonna say 220 because I never remember the point whatever um so yeah the last time I talked to you guys I was 220 and if you remember when I started all of this over started my weight loss journey over I was 237 so I went from 237 to 220 and as of this morning your girl is 215 so I dropped another five pounds and to be completely honest with you guys it was all that tea because your girl has not had a chance to work out i have I, of course i've been doing good as far as eating and getting my gallon in but no lie i really do feel like that tea is what got your girl to lose this like extra five pounds because i haven't been working out um work has just been crazy y'all when i i'm just saved it for another video like it may need to be a whole story time sis because they tried to play with your girl but anyway, oh, people are going to the pool. 
Oh, but anyway, yeah. So anyway, I am another five pounds down. And like I said, thank you so much to ISO T, NRG, Nutriverse. Like I honestly feel like that that is what carried me because I wasn't able to do my full routine. But like I always say, guys, always say you can't put everything in that product yes the product works if you let it work for you if you meet it halfway so although i wasn't able to work out i still was watching my calories or my points with weight watchers still drinking my gallon of water and still intermediate fasting and i still was able to drop another five pounds so i am now 15 pounds away from wonderland and i did start a new challenge in my weight loss group for july so i ain't even worried about the working out because it's a working out challenge um so yes i ain't even worried about it i'm just ready so i officially lost what let me do the math real quick girl is it 15 pounds hold on 237 take away 215 22 pounds why i get 15 pounds so for the month of june i lost 22 pounds so I have yeah i just have 15 pounds to get back to wonderland like it's crazy like like the difference between the first time is like I was doing it on my own, meaning I was counting calories, trying to figure out carbs and fats and proteins and doing all this stuff. And like this time I have Weight Watchers, which I have been on my Weight Watchers, y'all, like to the T tracking every single day. So much so I got a gift from Weight Watchers that I'm going to show y'all in this vlog. I just thought about it. So I'm going to show y'all when I update y'all about everything else. Um, But yeah, I got a gift from Weight Watchers because your girl did very good this last month staying on track. And and I'm telling you, it's just if you do your journey and I I understand weight loss. I mean, I understand working out is very, very important, especially if you're trying to contour and tone your body. But there is no excuses, y'all. Like I still was able to drop weight and I wasn't even able to work out like I was supposed to or whatever. So you can you can get it done. You can get it done. You just need to get your mind right and get it done. So I'm excited with my results again. I stand behind this product. I'm a distributor for this product because it work i know a lot of people do reach out and say oh well it didn't work for me the company has a very very great return policy no questions asked if it's within your 30 days of purchase you can return it for a full refund um and you know it's no questions asked so don't stress yourself out about that but don't sleep on something just because you have doubts you never know how to work for you like i told you guys when i first got this product i ain't gonna lie your girl thought i was gonna come on here and be like mm -mm, don't waste your time don't waste your money but no honey your girl hey i have what they call smart ship which means my stuff is on automatic draft <laughs> so they automatically take it out of my account and automatically ship it to me so i have a new shipment that's coming the week of the ninth so i'm ready for my re-up because i'm telling y'all i just man i just it's the possibilities or whatever but anyway i've been talking long enough let me jump into these questions because i told you guys to ask me some questions about the product that i can answer for you guys if you had any doubts and i think i got about eight or nine questions so i'll go ahead i don't even think it's that many but anyway i'll go ahead and get these questions asked and then we'll lastly go ahead and i'll update you on the apartment right, so jumping into the first question did it make you go to the bathroom a lot and if so did it impact you being able to be productive at work and the question to that is it depends as far as going to the bathroom a lot it depends on how backed up you are because remember the tea is only a detox like it is just it is just for you to take to actually use the restroom to get stuff out because we have a whole lot of stuff that gets caught in our colon on our colon wall and then you're running around thinking like why am i so big like why is my stomach so bloated it's just leftover bowel and you need to do a detox to get that out um so yes the tea does make you use the restroom but you can like i said earlier take it in the in the daytime in the middle of the day if you take it in the morning time i will say probably by the end of your day it depends on how early you take it if you're taking it super super early the tea works i think within five to six hours so just plan it on that sense like if you're taking it early early morning but again it's not like oh my god i gotta be home i gotta run to the restroom type of situation like you will know when you need to go use the restroom and like i say it just happens like it's very very gentle but yes i am able to take mine at work with no issues no running to the bathroom not even coming home like i got stuck in traffic one day yes traffic i can't believe it was traffic but i got stuck in traffic one day um and it was no problem like i literally still made it home and you know went on about my day so it is very gentle and yes you can take it earlier in the day the next question is it's really expensive do you think all the 
products are necessary for weight loss? And this is a really good question because I got this question like several times. And the complete answer, y'all know your girl is real, is I honestly don't feel like you need all of those. But if you were going to get a product, if you were going to get products, I think you should get what I get, which is the Nutriburst, and that's because that's a multivitamin. A lot of us don't take a multivitamin every day, and you need that because to be healthy, you need to make sure that all of your bodily functions are getting what they need, meaning vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin A, vitamin B, and there's no way that we're getting that what we need every day all day so you do need to take some type of multivitamin and i really like the nutriverse because it's a liquid multivitamin because not everybody wants to pop one of those big pills because y'all know vitamins since it is so much stuff in it they're pretty big so nobody wants to take that every day so it is a liquid vitamin it's got a little flavor to it, it tastes like a little orange juice you know it's morning time have a little orange juice little vitamin um shake it up very well i do get people telling me that you know it has a medicine taste and that's because because it is a vitamin so you need to shake it up very well so that way it can be mixed and then you know just take it as a shot and you shouldn't struggle with that vitamin taste and then the citrus taste is it's really good actually like to me I think it tastes like orange juice like no lie but if you can't just take it on its own there's no excuse you can put that in your smoothie you can add it to juice you can add it to a tea you can do what you want like it can be added to other stuff so you don't have to take it on your own but just take that shot go ahead and knock it back um but yeah I say get the Nutriburst because that's a multivitamin and the actual tea because that's what you need the detox and then the NRG because that's what you need to kill the appetite sis when I tell you y'all saw in the video I take that NRG when I'm fasting and I don't even literally even think about food like I only reason I break my fast is one because I know I can't water fast forever <laughs> and for two because like I cook I actually meal prep I actually put stuff together so I'm like okay Crystal you know what time it is it's time to break your fast go ahead and eat and like I said once I eat I get full fast so I can't eat a lot but that NRG is the truth like it gives you energy it gives you focus and it's a fat burner like I'm telling you that stuff is legit so those like if you were looking to get a kid I would say get that if you just wanted to buy a product like if you say which one I'm only buying one what would you buy energy 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 the detox tea is really good because it has you going to the restroom so that means you're constantly being cleaned out but I mean if you go to the restroom every day like you're supposed to like if you go and have a bowel movement every single day then you can pass on that tea but the NRG is the truth especially if you're trying to do IF which is intermediate fasting or water fasting or any of the sort it will get you all the way together when I tell y'all and believe it or not hold on I got a question y'all it was so funny hold on I'm gonna go read that well I got a comment um, and it says, well, she said question for the vlog, but I ended up answering her, but I had to bring it up. She said question for the vlog. Is it normal to not want to eat nothing all day? This is the second day for me. And I only drank the tea one time in the morning along with the Nutriburst. And then I had the energy. I work out in the morning and usually I'll be hungry afterwards, but for two days I haven't been. I find myself only eating because I know it's time to eat and I should. I have a very hard time getting down just a serving of tuna and a fruit crackers because I don't have an appetite. Like, I'm no longer interested in food. And I guess this is what's keeping me from overeating. And I'm telling y'all, the NRG is the truth. One pill. Just take one. That's all you need. And I take mine in the morning about 6.30 and literally like especially when i'm fasting i can go through a whole day fast come home do whatever y'all saw in the vlog like it is lit so if you only want to buy one product and one product only just to give it a try nrg is definitely what you need but if you do want to try you know the products all together nutriburst nrg and then whichever tea you decide whether it's the iso uh it's all iso tea but whether you do the raspberry lemonade which is cbd um the lemon which is cbd or the original which is just an original unsweet kind of tea or whatever and if you guys follow me on instagram i did do an insta story showing like what i do when i just drink the regular tea since it's not flavored but don't worry i'll end up showing it in a vlog one day um i just add lemon juice and um a sweet and low and it gets me all the way together so but yeah to wrap all that up if you do want to just try all the products to see how they go together then those are the three but if you just want to try one energy is the truth
Next question, when you are brand new, what should you start out with? And what I started out with was what I just told you guys, those three products, Nutriburst, T, and NRG. If you don't want to try the T, then do the Nutriburst and the NRG. If you don't want the Nutriburst because you already have a multivitamin that you like, then just do the NRG, you know? And see, the, the Nutriburst is not for weight loss. Like, and I put it in quotes because that's not something that you drink and it's gonna make you use the restroom or now I ain't gonna lie it does give you energy because it's a multivitamin and it has all the vitamins you need so it does give you a bit of energy but that's not it, it's not claiming to give you any weight loss like the iso t nrg is um so yeah if you have a multivitamin that you like i'll say go with the multivitamin that you like but i really do like that nutriburst um and yeah and the nrg so i would say so go ahead and just start out with nutriburst nrg and the t and if you do just want a couple products like i say anytime and i know i don't say it eight times now nrg is the truth <laughs> all right next question is does the nrg make you jittery i have a sample coming so i can't wait to try it i've taken the nutriburst and the tea i need something to curve my this massive appetite of mine thanks christy you look great thank you sis girl i'm trying to get back trying to get back um but no the nrg does not make you jittery i like i said on the packaging it does say take with food i never take mine with food i take mine in the morning time with only water and and i still do take my appetite vinegar just to let y'all know every single morning i still take my apple cider vinegar when i get up out the bed so i take apple cider vinegar and then i go ahead and do my morning routine showering doing my hair and everything then before i walk out the door is when i take my nrg and um i already have my water or whatever and i don't feel jittery at all it just it literally gives you that type of energy where you find yourself like talking fast and like working and like literally not even thinking about food you just working working and then you look up and you're like dang it's 11 like you just i'm talking about being productive as hell again i'm not i can only speak for myself these are my experiences guys like it's lit <laughs> that's all i'm gonna say <laughs> all righty next question do you drink the tea every day of the week yes i do i drink my tea every single day including saturday and sunday if you don't want to do two packets you can do one the reason that i do two packets which i think somebody asked that question the reason that i do two packets of tea is because if you read the directions it tells you to take one packet in a bottle of water twice a day so instead of doing that because i'm busy i don't have time to keep thinking like oh shoot did i take my tea is this my first tea is this my second tea i don't have time to think about that i just put two of them in one bottle and get it done and i do it 30 minutes before my lunch so every day about 12 30 or 1 is when i'm drinking my tea next question is there an added benefit in mixing the two packets and it's not it's just me like i said just making sure that i'm doing the two packets every single day but my mom actually uses this tea as well and i have to ask her how many pounds she has lost but she has dropped some pounds too um and she only does no she does do two packets she don't do one packet she started off with one oh and that's what i want to say if you are starting off if this your first time and you've never done a detox which i think i told you guys this either early in this vlog or last vlog you do want to start with one packet just to get your system ready for it just to let your body know like hold on sis somebody is in here finna clean us out that's what you want to do um so my mom did start with one packet um every day but after the first week she went to two packets so that's the only reason that i do it all right guys so here's the last question what have you noticed after taking these products do they have any side effects did you have to take them all together to see results and which one do you definitely recommend okay so she asked four questions in one so first question what have you noticed after taking these products i have noticed that they are very gentle like i told y'all i'm kind of the detox queen i give myself that title because i have had fit tea um flat tummy tea shaper tea teamy tea and that iso tea so your girl has been detoxing for years and the one thing that i can say that i love the most is one this is instant there's no brewing i don't have to like worry about any of that i literally open a packet put it in the bottle shake it and i can drink it and then for two i noticed that it's very gentle with all my other detox teas even like my smooth move tea that i bought from uh, target like that once you take it it's kind of like a laxative it kind of like 
you know, like boom, you gotta go, like, oh, knock down doors and go. But for this, like I said, I can take it in the daytime and not have to worry about that, not have to stress, like, oh my god, I'm at work, am I gonna have to use these people's bathroom, or oh my god, I'm out in public, am I gonna have to use a public restroom? I don't have to worry about that. It's very gentle, and it's kind of just like when you go to the restroom, you know, you go, you know what I'm saying? So, I do notice that it's very, very gentle. Um, do they have any side effects? The only side effects I have saw sis is weight loss, like, legit, I've lost. 22 pounds 22 pounds and again i haven't been working out like i'm supposed to so yes your day work <laughs> um did you have to take all these products together in order to see results and like i said earlier i don't think that you necessarily have to have the nutriburst if you have a multivitamin that you already like but if you're not taking a multivitamin then you definitely need to have some type of multivitamin in your life just to give you all the vitamins that your body and nutrients that your body needs because a lot of people get to either a stall in their weight loss or they get to a point where they are not seeing weight loss and it could be the health part of it where maybe your iron is too low or your cholesterol is too high or your body is holding on to water like it could be so many factors as to why you're not losing weight so that's why a lot of people get these products and then they're like oh they don't work for me so in that sense though if you are doing everything that you know you're supposed to do if you know you're eating healthy in a calorie deficit you're drinking your water you're working now you're doing all this stuff and you're not losing weight then i say honestly go see a doctor and get tested to see if your levels are you know doing good or if your hormones are acting up because so many things affect us as women when it comes to weight loss or whatever so yeah you definitely want to do that but you do need a multivitamin something every day so you can go without the nutriburst if you have a multivitamin that you're already taking but i honestly don't feel like you need everything like i feel like if you just buy the tea that's gonna clean you out and that is gonna is what making you lose weight because the whole part of the tea and what people don't realize is the tea is not a fat burner the tea is a detox meaning it has you go use the restroom and ultimately if you're using a restroom and getting yourself cleaned out then you ultimately see your bloating your belly goes down because there's not stored bile that's in there or whatever so that's all the tea is y'all it's just a detox you know what i'm saying like don't get this and think it's a diet pill don't get it and think it's weight loss surgery don't think I mean, don't get it and think that you can eat Wingstop every day and you still gonna lose weight. No, you still gotta put in the work in your journey, but this just helps you by having you be regular enough to where you won't have all this stuff stored up in you. And then lastly, not, not um, NRG is a pill. Not everybody is, you know, on to that. Not everybody wants their appetite suppressed. Some people just want to, you know, be able to, you know, do whatever. So, like I said, you don't necessarily need every single product to, um, see weight loss or see results but i mean i feel like if you're going to invest your money in the tea in the energy and stuff then you can go ahead you know get the vitamin the tea and the nutriburst they do have resolution drops which i heard kill the appetite way more than nrg so i definitely will be getting a resolution drop so i can do a comparison on the nrg and the resolution drops for you guys because like i said i heard the resolution drops like make you don't even think about food like somebody say food and you get mad so definitely gonna have to try those out because if it's anything stronger than that nrg i'm gonna be on a permanent water fast <laughs> um and which one do you definitely recommend i think i've said that so many times in this video nrg sis if you just want to buy one thing nrg <laughs> So yes guys, I hope I answered all your questions. If I didn't, then leave them down below. And then once I see the comments in this video, then I'll just answer them in the next video or whatever. And I know I probably repeated myself so much about that NRG, but I, I am really shook. Like when I first took it, I literally, cause my mom started taking it before me. So when I call her, I'm like, I think something ain't right. She's like, what? I'm like, I'm not hungry. And she's like, you took the NRG? I'm like, yeah. She's like, yeah, it kills your appetite. I'm like, Every day, like at first I just thought like maybe because I knew I took a new product that was going on, but it's been over a month y'all and it still do it. Like even when I'm at home, I have to, when I take it on Saturday and Sundays, I'm just like, okay, it's time to eat Crystal, you need to get up and eat. And on Saturday and Sunday, I don't even eat three meals a day. I literally eat my breakfast when I break my fast and then I eat dinner. Like I skip lunch because I'm not even hungry whatsoever even though today is the third and mother nature decided to rear her little head up yeah she here she get on my nerves but it is totally okay because with my nrg i took my nrg this morning and your girl ain't had an appetite now i did treat myself to a dunkin donuts iced coffee okay let me tell y'all something i stay near a dunkin donut now 
and I never knew that their iced coffee was this lit. Like, why didn't nobody tell me? I'm kind of mad at y'all, but it is lit. So this is pretty much just a Dunkin' Donuts iced coffee, and I got mocha swirl flavor in it, um, and it's really, really good. And I like to like let mine see it just gets better, get better, and then I like to use my my uh, metal straws with it because it keeps it cold. Mm love it love it love it um but yeah that i this morning for breakfast i did have two eggs scrambled with um cheese and then i had some turkey sausage and then i had two slices of toast that's what i had for breakfast and then this i guess is my lunch and then i mean i'm not even hungry so i can't even tell you what i'm gonna eat for dinner i still do have my broccoli cheddar soup um it was lit y'all that soup was so lit um and then i still do have some meatloaf muffins because I was thinking that I was gonna eat three or four of those and I could only eat two. So it's, I'm telling y'all like, I ain't complaining. That's it, I'm not gonna keep beating that dead horse. It's just, it's, it's lit y'all, it's lit. And if you do wanna purchase these products, the first link in the description box is where you can go. That's my site and you can purchase from there. Um, and if you do purchase, DM me, let me know you purchase. And then when you get your purchase, you know, keep it girl updated because I purchase these products as well. Let me just let y'all know, I don't get anything free or anything discounted from TLC. Yes, I am a distributor, but that's what I like most about it because if they sent me the product or if I got the product at a discounted rate or something, then you can kind of just be like, oh, okay, well, she trying to sell it. But I pay the same price you guys pay. So my new products that's coming in for the three that I buy, that 183, I pay that 183 out of my pocket as well so that's why i said it. it's not me just saying oh y'all try these products like clearly you see that they're working your girl is 215 and i was 237 at the start of this month well at june 1st um so i'm just gonna continue to go because if this was just the first month hold on sis give me two more months give me two more months like it's lit but yes i do purchase these at full price myself as well and i'm going to continue to purchase some or whatever but yeah if you do want to purchase some go down below if you have been even thinking about being a distributor because you like the product so much and you want to sell it or whatever then you can also go to my site below and there is a link um and when you go to the site you can say become a life changer because that's what it's called um and then you can sign up and like i said you don't have to sign up under me you can sign up under anybody else that you know because y'all know these distributors taking over <laughs> um so you can just sign up on anyone but i'm just telling you like i i'm loving it so far I, i'm loving it so so far but if you do have any questions or concerns dm me on instagram the people who have dm me we do talk a lot um baby done woke up what you looking at <laughs> she oh, woke up yeah i'm right here hold on i'm recording um y'all she done woke up um i lost my thought because she woke up you miss me that's why i'm recording Huh. Oh no, I was talking about because I don't want you to come in there. Y'all know how baby always wanna wear what she wanna wear. She can't be on camera like that. Hey y'all. Say hey louder. Hello. <laughs> I think they heard you. Hello. But um oh yeah, I was saying if y'all do DM me on Instagram or whatever, if you have any questions or whatever, you know I'll talk to you or whatever. So that's all I gotta say for this portion, which was longer than I expected. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some updates and then we're gonna end this video out. What? Say hey to the people. <laughs> Mm, 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 mm. I can't TikTok you. I am trying. She ain't trying because anybody, she don't even have a TikTok account. If anybody is an instructor for TikTok, call on me. I feel so old. Anyway, guys, let me show y'all what I have got for the patio. So, these right here, I just put them right here. These are for the patio. These are those lanterns that you can put the candles in. Now, you don't want to put real candles in them, but you can get, like, the battery-operated ones. Or you could just put, you know, candles in there for show. You don't have to light them. And guess what? Bought this at Dollar General, y'all. They were $20, and these are 18-inch black lanterns. And my thought for these is just to get like the three different size candles and put in there but i'm gonna get the um ones from amazon with the remote so that way they can be like set on a timer to go on and go off because these are going on the patio but when i saw these i was like yes i have to get these now they do have another size um this is 18 inch and i want to say they had a 12 inch one 
Um, but I wanted both the same size. I didn't want two of two different sizes. So yeah, I got both 18 inch. So that's the first thing I got for the patio. And let me take you to the patio to show you the second thing. And here is the second thing for the patio. Your girl got an outdoor rug. I did purchase this from Amazon and it was $43. And it is that kind of wicker material. So it is outdoor safe for rain. Um, it doesn't fade. I read the reviews and it had really good reviews. And as you can see, the color scheme for the patio is gonna be black and white and i'm gonna do like a pop of greenery just kind of just like oh i want to show y'all the pool but there are people in the pool so i don't want to put their business in the street but yes the patio furniture is next to come so don't you worry but like i told y'all i am gonna do like a full video but this is how that rug is looking oh my god i love it so much i knew when i saw this that i was definitely gonna do this pattern so the cushions for the patio furniture is gonna be this color too y'all i'm just i'm just lit lit so yeah this is the patio for the rug i mean the rug for the patio and here is what the glam room is looking like still love this rug y'all i vacuumed it today and it's just man this rug is lit all the links to everything that's in this room or anything that's in the apartment that i got from amazon is below it's underneath i think i titled it like amazon links that i talk about or something all the links are down there you can um go down there if you want anything that i got from amazon but y'all it is lit i love this rug if y'all see this little thing right here i bought this from dollar not dollar general family dollar it was only five dollars and it's battery operated you can turn it off and it's like mirrored and then it says girl boss and i got this one because they have one that says dream and one that says good vibes but y'all know pink is my color so that's why i had to get this and we claiming it girl boss we claiming it now the way my desk looks right now with this stuff i am not keeping it at all but y'all know that's the stuff that used to be in the living room so i just put it right here for now so my desk wouldn't look naked but but I'm definitely not keeping it. I just need to get to the stores to see what's out there. Another thing that I bought from Family Dollar were these dice. And it is like, it says different stuff on each side. So have faith, pray often, be kind, love more, stay wild and live simply so i have it on half faith and then i just got this because it matched my room and then this one says be spontaneous enjoy the sunshine eat dessert first dance like no one is watching choose joy and then sing out loud so um i had it on be spontaneous so i got these they're not staying here i just put them right there but i do i am gonna decorate these cubbies like i told y'all i haven't decided what i'm gonna do but yeah, I got these from Family Dollar as well. And these were $3.50 a piece. And then my other bins came in. So this is what it's looking like. This is the design me and baby came up with. Um, so yeah, and it looks like that on both sides is identical. Um, and then inside the black bins will be all their makeup. And I'm not going to even put it in this vlog because this vlog is already too long. So next vlog, I'll show you guys all my makeup and how I'm going to organize it within the bins. I am still looking for my desk. I have not found one. Oh, and it's like stressing out because it's like I don't want to rush, <laughs> but I'm still looking for that. And then I also am still waiting on my curtains. They gave us a date that they said they will be delivered, but I hadn't got them. But don't worry because they are coming so you guys can see that. So this is what the Glam office is looking like right now. I'm loving it so much. I was sitting in here editing today and I felt so professional. Like I told you guys, um, I am getting a lot of people that are asking about the tea buying the tea and stuff so i just needed an area that i can like sit down and actually focus and answer emails and stuff so yes this has been amazing i, I i'm loving it so so much and the last thing that i want to update you guys on is the vacuum cleaner that we bought i'm gonna put y'all down alrighty guys so i put it here against the wall here is the vacuum cleaner i love it so much already it is a dyson v7 and it is detachable it comes in three parts so this is the actual like bristle thing that actually cleans the floors it works on carpet rugs um hard wood tiles but bathroom tiles like all that and i love it this middle part right here is simply just a stick this part right here is where all the power is um you can put it on max suction or just high suction um this right here is where all the dust and dirt goes in this right here is the filter 
and to get this out i love that you don't have to touch nothing you just pull this lever back of this pops open you can just throw everything in the trash that was on the floor this part right here as you can see is detachable and it comes with these pieces right here so this right here is an extender so you can hook this onto the pink part and then that way you can clean the ceiling fans and everything like that and then this part right here is to clean out couches or you can actually take it and clean out your cars and you hook that to this part right here and then you can use it as a hand vac so yes guys this does retail for a whole lot of money i me and courtney both ain't never spent this much money on the vacuum cleaner it was 300 dollars, but it is definitely worth it this right here is the dyson v7 motorhead and i actually want to do a full review on it because when i was like looking forward to like kind of compare it not many people did a review on it so i want to do a review on it because it was very easy to put together i love it it only takes three hours to fully charge because it's cordless um and then after that you can use it for a while and then you can just put it back on the charger so that way it's ready the next time you need to grab it um i was doing something in the kitchen let me turn y'all around <laughs> all right i was trying to find my lighting but yeah i was doing something in the kitchen the other day when i was cooking and i dropped a bunch of stuff and i was just like Oh Lord, I'm had to sweep this up. And I was like, uh-uh. And I literally got it and put it on max suction. And y'all, shoot, it just got everything up. Like, yeah. It's lit. So we did get that. Got the other patio stuff. Everything came in as far as my shelves. Like I said, now I just got to get to organizing. And I am finding a desk. I'm giving myself another week to find a desk before I just have to settle and go to Ikea and just get a regular tabletop desk. Like, I didn't want to do that. I actually wanted to find something cute. But at the end of the day, I need an area set up, especially now since I'm about to um, get my hair and stuff done. I'm gonna need an area to like, you know, get myself together in the morning time. So that'll be the last thing that I'm gonna do in here. And then I am going to get um, the curtain. I need to, I decided what curtain rod I'm gonna get. So I gotta go pick that up. And then I want to get like some art for just over here, whatever. But I'll bring you guys along on that process or whatever. So that is the update. I don't think it's nothing else I had to update, update y'all on. Um, we still haven't picked our living room furniture. I still haven't decorated the kitchen because I haven't even been anywhere. So, yeah, I think I got you guys pretty much updated on everything. So sorry. Like I said, it took me so long to get this video out. I have been going through a lot, and I'll tell you guys more about that in another video. If you are wanting to try the tea, you can go to the site. They do have sample packets. So you can buy a sample of the tea, a sample of the NRG, a sample of the Nutriburst if you want to try it before you buy it. But if you do go ahead and go full throttle and buy the full product and you get it and you don't like it or you think it doesn't work for you, then you do have 30 days to return it. But the one thing that I can say is you don't know until you try. All of us can come on here and tell you our experience. We can show you the results. Um, we can come on here and tell you to buy it just because. But at the end end of the day you won't know till you actually try it yourself and like i said yes i am a distributor but if you know somebody who sells it and you want to go through them no hurt feelings sis i just want everybody to see these results because it's too lit for lit but if you do want to purchase from me the description i mean the link is in the description box everything that i got from amazon um from my room or in the apartment is in the description box as well so you can link that um down there and i'm just so ready for the patio furniture to get here and just to get everything like get get everything going but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and end out the vlog this time go ahead and stay tuned the next vlog i am going to show you guys some more recipes because i have picked up some more recipes i'm going to try a breakfast recipe i'll show you guys how to make the broccoli cheddar soup i already showed you guys the meatloaf muffins and the alfredo sauce um and then I'll just keep showing you guys, you know, how the product is working for me as far as T, uh, TLC. Because as of right now, your girl's 22 pounds down and loving it. Now, like I told y'all, Mother Nature is up on us. But we ain't going to even let her go nowhere because that NRG got her in check, honey. <laughs> um, I am starting the challenge in my Facebook group starting June, July 6th, which is coming up Monday. So if you're in a group, get ready, sis, because we about to get real fine. Like, this challenge, we doing before and after pictures. That's how lit it's about to be. But I'm going to go ahead and end it out for today, baby. You got something to say? Wear your mask, y'all. Oh, baby, say wear the mask. Just wear the mask. Wear the mask. It's not that serious. It's it's just wear it and protect everybody around you. It's just, it's sad. It's sad out here. Wear your mask. Talk to people. Black Lives Matter. And I know, I know y'all thinking, like, Krista, it's a lot of stuff going on. Don't yeah. worry. We'll talk about Black Lives Matter. So
We're gonna talk about everything, don't you worry, because I got something to tell y'all. So, yes, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end it out today. Like I said, everything else, me and baby, we're gonna talk to y'all because we got some serious stuff to talk to y'all about. We got some not serious stuff to talk to y'all about. Don't worry, you won't know what we gotta talk to y'all about, though, if you ain't subscribed. So, this is your time to go ahead and subscribe and turn your notification bell on to be notified when we post the next video. And I'll see you guys soon.